So this is the new Aerox droop gauge system. Um, it's supplied with a regular 10 millimeter box, the droop gauge itself, and the, the disc that sits, screws onto the wheel. I'm just gonna read you a little bit of information about it. Um, droop is a measurement used to define the point at which the tire leaves contact with the ground. It can be a very powerful tool to quickly change the behavior of a car. Measuring droop to the axle center is the most accurate way of doing so, as it eliminates any potential discrepancy in the symmetry of the suspension components. This method is the only correct way to quickly and easily compare droop across different cars without the need to account for different differences in car design. So it's really hard when you look at a setup sheet from one car that's got a droop of say five, and the same from another car that's got the same droop of five. They could be completely different figures depending on where the droop is measured on the car and how big the suspension components are. So the Aerox system is set out to get rid of that um, discrepancy in, in car design by measuring the droop to the center of the axle every time. So it's pretty simple to use. You've got your 10 mil blocks, you place the car on the 10 mil block as normal. You fasten the droop wheel or disc, and then you measure the droop on the droop gauge as you would normally. So this has got a droop of 23. That's 23 millimeters from the center of the axle to the floor, taking out the 10 mil block. So it's a, a repetitive way of measuring the droop of the car. It's got an easy storage function for the wheels, so you don't lose them in your tool bag. You just fasten straight onto the side of the cage like that. There we go, the Aerox Droop Gauge System.